the boundaries. However, 33% of the average of women's participation in hackathons, so it's not like every hackathon has the inclusiveness of the majority hacking, sadly. And why is that? Uh, the hacker thing, usually people tend to talk about the white guy behind the screen doing really cool stuff. Um, and sadly, this is still like a very common tradition, so people think of hackathons and think about this guy. Also, the better limitation, better nutritional values, so people think about hackathons that put their own big pizza all day, all night. And that is not very inclusive, especially if you are lactose intolerant or if you don't like pizza. And also, people think, I'm going to the hackathon, I'm going to be tired, um, I will not do anything behind the screen. What do we need to change that? Um, I created a happy girl with Natalia uh, in Brazil. So essentially we start the hack from the scratch. We have two editions, one was presentation, that is this picture, and we had one online one in 2022. And in 2022, um, we created like focus on women. So we put like women on the team, women on the mentors, and also it's really women focus. So anyone could attend, but we want women to attend. We created like event support activities. That was essentially the mentoring and doing check-ins to see how people are going through the hackathon. And also the event warm-up, there was the workshops, and also getting the people to make the team together. And what we found during the hackathon? Essentially, women wanted to join besides about learning, doing projects. They also were there for personal challenges, so people that are not coding for like years went to back coding through the hackathons. Also, career transition, so people that are not from tech are trying to go for tech careers. And also, hackathons having a social team also attract women, so they are doing this not only for the code, but for the a good project that can bring back to society. Also, we found really interesting that besides uh, making a cool idea, they also want to become part of our community. So we see here the hackathon community is really strong and we can change the world and we want us also interested in that. And besides we thinking that they didn't join hackathons because they don't want to contribute to really people they don't know, they actually are more like scared about the self-technical skills. And benefits about hackathon focus on women, they have like a safe space, a learning environment, they have perceptions, friendship bounds, cooperation, comfort to talk about things considered taboo, like the periods, which really is things that we are kind of shy to talk, and also identification, so they are able to see other people like that during the And what you can do as a human person, you can provide healthy food, you can encourage women to participate, so actually like make a post saying women are invited to join. This seems very small, but it's really powerful. Also, invite women to mentor, they easily are kind of shy, but they are busy. Have moments of bounding and fun, and make sure that everyone feels okay with the event. So, that is my QR code. If you want to find me and read the research, that's it. Thank you.